<laughs> this is this is going to be kind of fun here. Um, what does your car say about you? And no, we're not talking about a talking car in this case. <laughs> when it comes to dating, it may be what's on the inside that counts, but it's what outside that attracts. So San Diego dating coach Deanna Lorraine and LeaseTrader.com got together and did a little humorous study, take a closer look at this crazy world of dating and finding out what type of a woman the, the vehicle attracts. Mm -hmm. Yeah, when, a, when okay. a girl looks we'll at the guy's car. Or not. Okay, okay, okay. I'm let's just, just a messenger. Okay, yeah, that's right. <laughs> okay. So, we've been talking about this all morning, going, uh -huh. hmm, I wonder what this one is. But, but first of all, how'd you come up with this study? Well, we thought it'd be really interesting and fun. And then, you know, there is some truth to it, too, definitely, from what women's perspectives are. So, we just thought we'd sort of put the two and two together and, and see what well, we can do. Well, usually with. that's sitcom fodder. You know, <laughs> somebody says, you know, the first thing that they say is, oh, by the way, what kind of car do you drive? Yeah. You know, uh, you know, a. Uh, 95 Explorer. Oh, thank you very much. And they turn around and walk away. You know? Yeah, oh, well, uh, hopefully Mercedes. Oh, well, hi. You're interesting. Exactly. Corvette. Ooh, cheesy. <laughs> yeah. Well, you know, hopefully they're not deal breakers here or anything, but a lot of times when, you know, that's the first impression, basically, when someone steps out of a car. Okay, so, so, so what's the list here? Because you, you compared a certain, uh, you had five cars, mm -hmm. really, in categories. Yeah. Well, I guess we could go with the suburban, you know, or the SUV type of cars. Those, uh, the men who drive them tend to be family oriented, down to earth, and likes travel, friends, and family. Okay, I, got, I, I drive an Explorer. Okay, perfect. So, so that's that kind of fitting right? there? Yes, it does, okay. it does. And then the women who tend to be attracted to those men are also down to earth and, um, you know, they're not really the prissy type. They can be kind of tomboyish or, um, you know, they don't mind getting their hands dirty every once in a while, but down to earth nonetheless. Okay. And then, okay. what about a ni the nicer car, like a Mercedes? A Mercedes, uh, the man who drives it tends to be sort of older and sophisticated, successful. Uh, yeah, I used to have one of those. Oh, you did? When I was successful. <laughs> now, when? now you're more down to earth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was in the car before the Explorer. <laughs> they also tend to be sugar daddies a little bit. Yeah, well, 